Good morning. Dylan is still asleep. I, wait, what's today? Sunday. I've been trying to like wake up earlier. I just feel like whenever I'm on a more timed schedule and like a routine every day, I get way more done um, because I've been waking up at like nine and like that's restful and all, but I don't know. Sorry, I'm still working on coffee right now. I need to like drink coffee to finish sentences right now. But anyways, woke up at like seven or so, laid around, and then I made some coffee. And now I'm just answering some emails, looking at TikTok stuff. I'm just gonna kind of play on my phone for a little bit and catch up on some things on there. And then I'm gonna go wake up Dylan. And I'm gonna say this like I do in every vlog. I don't know if I'm gonna post this. Like, I honestly have no clue what I'm gonna do today, but follow along. Cheers. Who are you guys subscribed to on YouTube? I'm curious. So I used to watch it literally religiously like YouTube um, every single day every single night um, but life got a little busy and I got out of my like routine of doing that I'm trying to get back in it because I just love watching them they like kind of make me feel productive I look so bad <laughs> Are you awake? Yeah. So this morning I got up early and I put this pillow here so he would think it was me. But I tricked him. Tricked me. Oh, we set up long fingers. Or was it big palms? Wow, you have very big palms. And kind of like very skinny. Like spider fingers. Yeah, like I'm spider fingers. I'm gonna be like a spider old man when I'm, when I'm older. <laughs> I'm essentially turning into a spider. I'm essentially just one big spider. <laughs> Did you show everyone my new armpits? I mean, if you really want to talk about them. Can you see them? Yeah. And I trimmed them. I trimmed his armpit hair. They look so good. But she tied me down. No, you were she playing on your me. phone. He was playing on his phone while I gave him a little, little trim. I'm just doing some apples and almond butter this morning. And I'll probably just do a snack later. Um, I wish this looked prettier, but it doesn't. But the taste kind of slaps, so. Um, Dole's gonna have some cereal. It's this toasted berry crisp by Kashi. So, then we're gonna go work out. So this is why it takes me, or takes us forever to do anything, but I was just talking to Dill. A lot of people wonder what he is, and he's Greek and Lebanese, and for some reason, Lebanese just clicked with me, and I was like, whoa, you're like Middle Eastern, and he was like, yeah, and I was like, I don't know why that's never like clicked, I don't know why. And so I was like, wait, who is, who is Lebanese? So anyways, here's my research. And it's so crazy because these people like actually look like Dill. Jenna Tatum. That's Dylan. It's me with, as a woman. It's Vince Vaughn. Dylan, you are Vince Vaughn. Vince Vaughn? You weren't being serious, were you? Dill, Shakira is Lebanese. Shakira, Shakira. Oh, baby, when you talk like that, you make me. <laughs> you look like Jenna, Jenna Tatum. What do you think I am? German, Irish. Uh. I think I've told you that. I mean, you're just European. Yeah. German, Irish. England, English. 
I really am. Like, I have, like, ancestors from England. Is it British? That coffee is still kicking in this morning. I wonder what Greek, Lebanese, like, what our children would look like. Should we Google it? Ah, okay, so... Jenna Tatum. She's Lebanese, Polish. Polish, and on the other side is German and England. So essentially, Jenna Tatum is me and Dylan. Okay, so we got our little Fitbits on, and we're going to go on a jog, and I think I'm just going to do some abs and booty. Hopefully, I can get up my um, workout routine. <laughs> Hopefully I can get up my workout routine, and if I do, then I will get here. And if I don't, then, uh, <laughs> uh. I'll probably not bring my camera. Actually, who am I kidding? I'm definitely not gonna bring my camera on this run. On my phone, so I can listen to music. And if anything interesting happens, I'll record it. And if not, then wish me luck. Okay, went ahead and showered. I did some face makeup. I'm gonna do the rest of my makeup because I'm gonna do some TikToks and content and stuff. Um, but I'm gonna go ahead and prep some stuff for dinner. It's gonna be taco night, um, some chicken tacos in the crock pot, which crock pots used to scare me because I was like, how can something so yummy and like flavorful come out of a crock pot? But it's actually really easy. So it's like three ingredients. My roommate thinks I'm a for teaching me, and I'll just show you what I put in it. We're going to add some chicken breasts. Um, it asks for three to four chicken breasts. And once the chicken is in here, I'm gonna go in with one cup of salsa. I'm just gonna be using um, this one. You pour it in there. And one packet of taco seasoning. So the chicken can be frozen if you want, and if it is, then you can just cook it on high for like five hours. But since this one's already thawed out, maybe I'll cook it on high for like three and a half, and then kind of check on it from there. And bam, chicken tacos, yay. Okay, so um, I filmed some TikToks. I feel like those aren't interesting for me to vlog just because, but let me know if they are. Um, but I was playing with some lip colors today and I thought you guys might be interested. I got a bunch of stuff from Hourglass, which holy cow, I can't believe they sent me a little box, like super, super sweet of them. I'm gonna show you this lip combo. Let me make sure there's nothing on my lips. Okay, so since I'm a little crusty, I'm gonna start with this lip oil by them. You could totally use this at night or like in the morning or whatever. But I just feel like I need a little bit of moisture on these lips per usual. And then I went in with, it's called Influencer. <laughs> yeah, well, it's really pretty. Okay. And then I'm gonna go in with this gloss and I was really impressed with this gloss. It's called Unreal. By them I'm gonna layer it over top of it I don't have any glosses this color I don't know if you can see it if it'll focus but it's like a muted uh, desaturated pink uh, this is why I will never be a makeup description person so pretty I feel like my lips are never this tone. It's a little bit more muted than my fairly pink lip that I usually go for. Let's see in this light. I really like it. So I'll have to throw those in my purse for a nice little everyday kind of lip. This is a good trick. I'm sure a lot of you know this, but if you put your finger like in your lip, it's gonna help it not get on your teeth. See, that would have gotten all over my teeth. We got toilet paper delivered! <laughs> I, I don't know, I think I ordered more than 14. Right? And truth is. Wow, it's like single things. Yeah, that's great. I'll take All it. Right. So, what I'm doing, I'm trying to, I wish I could show you, but I'm like using these forks and just kind of like, like, 
Forking it? I don't know. What is it called? What? Forking it? Yeah. You gotta fork the chicken. What is it called? It's pretty forked up. Don't fork them this way. Dylan! What? Um, well, while I'm at it, lip update. I put this on, like... 35 minutes ago and we're still doing good so it's safe to say I don't, I don't know where I was going with that all right chicken is ready um, I'm just heating up some peppers and asparagus and we're gonna put that in there um, some tortillas Dill's gonna have the big ones and I personally like these smaller ones um, they just are like street tacos basically Get some cheese up in here. I feel like that looks like professional with like the cheese. It looks so good. <laughs> Thank you. Mm. Mm. I like eating my taco over the second taco. So if anything falls out, it just mm. adds into the second taco. We are going to see the sunset and then see a little bioluminescence. Bioluminescence, bioluminescence, and bioluminescence, bioluminescence, for you kids at home. Uh, it's like when the water shines. I think it's something to do with like plankton, and they like make light and stuff. I got an A in marine biology my senior year in high school, so don't quote me on that. But you can also quote me on that. <laughs> I gotta see. <laughs> you get so many questions on this little tie dye situation, like that uh, TikTok I posted. Everybody's asking about it. Zoom in. Visor. My name's out there. Gucci, Dior, Fenty, Visor. Chanel. Chanel, Visor. All five letters. Uh, so, anyways. Wait, are they five letters? Wait, everything is actually five letters? Gucci and Chanel are five letters. Visor's five letters. What about Louis? L-O-U-I-S. Fendi. F-E-N. Oh, what? Let's go! <laughs> <laughs> you look like Little Red Riding Hood. <laughs> yeah, little Red Riding Hood if she had a TikTok. Little Red Riding Hood is bad though. So that was pretty neat. My face mask smelled like guacamole. So I kind of wish they were scented if I'm being honest. What would you go for in my, your scented face, my face mask? mask? I'd probably want like jasmine <laughs> with a little bit of mint. All right. Well, my hair right this second for one second, it looked like Malfoy from Harry Potter. How does it make you feel like when Draco Malfoy was cast for the role, it's like, hey, we're gonna have you play somebody that's just universally hated by the entire world. So have fun with that. Like if I saw the actor for whoever played Malfoy, I'd be like, yo. Like are you automatically signing up for people to possibly have a little bad taste in their mouth I, against I, you just because it's your character? Oh, you know what I would say? You know what I would say? Honestly, what? I, what? I would honestly say this. If I saw him on the street, I would say, give it here, Malfoy, or I'll knock you off your broom. And I'd say it like this, ready? Are you ready? Well, this is my moment. Well, I'm turning the light on for you. This is my moment. Okay. Are you ready? Give it here, Malfoy, or I'll knock you off your broom. Scene. How was it? Harry. Who says like that? That's, that's Ron. Oh, come on, Harry. How many times have you watched Harry Potter? 
I don't know. I think I've seen like the first three. I'd be part Hufflepuff and part, uh, what's the other one? Gryffindor, Slytherin, Hufflepuff, Ravenclaw. Ravenclaw. I'm gonna be Gryffindor. Basic. Ravenclaw is like the party group. Hogwarts is like pretty chill. Hogwarts is Slytherin. like Hogwarts is like state. Gryffindor is like the the goody two shoes that don't go to parties. They just study. Ravenclaw is like the brats and the, and the sororities. But Slytherin. And Slytherin's like the stoners, the burnouts. <laughs> Hufflepuff is just like the athletes. You know, the people that play the sports. You know, I'm a Ravenclaw. Okay, we are back and it's already nine o'clock so i think i'm just gonna like turn on the tv and chill i won't vlog that um but hopefully this was semi an interesting vlog and um please like comment please subscribe that's what makes me keep doing all of this craziness and pulling out my camera every five minutes so thank you to all of you guys who have subscribed and um, let me know what other types of videos you want to see down below. I'm really hunkering down on my like uh, filming schedule. So let's make a good one. <laughs> Anyways, um, have an amazing day or night wherever you are. Mwah.